welcome to the Ria and Drea show. Just kidding, welcome back to the G Suite show. And today, we are excited to talk about how G Suite integrates with Jamboard. Jamboard is a cloud-based collaborative whiteboard allowing people to sketch out ideas and inspire each other. And just like G Suites, you can collaborate easier on projects. I mean, let's face it, it's tough to keep track of all those ideas on these sticky notes and napkins. Oh, watch out, they're in order. Oh, my bad. And while we'll mainly be focusing on how G Suite tools integrate with Jamboard, we definitely wanted to make sure that we touched on a few points. So, it's easy to draw, arrange, write, and erase any of my work on Jamboard's 4K touchscreen. And I can easily view and participate using any tablet or phone using my Jamboard app, just like how you would normally do it with docs, sheets, slides, uh, and begin collaborating. And although Jamboard isn't a G Suite core service, it integrates easily with G Suite apps. Let's say, for example, I want to create a mood board for a G Suite show event. Um, I pick up one of the slides from our original proposal desk, and we can talk about the number of guests, the budget, and all the details. From the Jamboard's toolbar, I just touch the search web or search images icon to search for relevant content. When I find what I want, I drag and drop my selection onto the screen. I can also add content from G Suite using the Jamboard app. I either create a new jam or open an existing one. Let's check out a jam we started earlier in the week. I'll then tap Add a Drive File. I can select files from docs, slides, sheets, and even photos stored in Drive. And with a single tap, send them to the Jamboard. Jamboard supports up to 16 touch points at once on a single device. And even more people can join using the app. So collaboration is a cinch. To share my jam with others, I just open the menu, select Add People, and add them by email address or name. On the same menu, I can also check the slider labeled Link Sharing to make a link to the jam that can be shared with anyone. Jamboard also works with Google Hangouts and Hangouts Meet. To join a Hangout from the Jamboard menu or from the app, I just select Join a Meeting and enter the meeting code or name from the calendar invite. At any time, whether I'm using the Jamboard or the Jamboard app, I can select Present to Meeting to present my screen, and when I'm finished, I can stop presenting with the same button. I can also send a copy of my Jam to others by choosing the Send a Copy option from the Jamboard menu. I can send the Jam as a PDF of all frames or a PNG file of just the current one. When I first create a Jam, I just enter my email and confirm myself as owner. Jamboard automatically saves my work after that. So no more worrying about someone mistaking your brilliant idea for a doodle or tossing it in trash. I could have been the next Larry Page. You are adorable. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm finished with my work, I just select Close This Jam from the Jamboard menu. I can access a saved jam at any time on my phone or tablet by selecting it from my list of jams. For more information on how to integrate G Suite with Jamboard, check out this link. And for any of your questions, thoughts, or feedback on G Suite with Jamboard, let us know in the comment section. Until next time, see ya from Rhea and Drea. <laughs> Take a look at last week's episode where we head to the Transformation Gallery to create a digital time card for employees and projects.